The Houston Museum of Natural Science is one of our favorite places to visit in Houston, Texas. Join us as we explore all four floors of the museum. The Houston Museum of Natural Science. You guys ready to go to the Science Museum? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> See this new zone here? Matter motion. You ready to check it out? I like this It's like an arcade up in here. <laughs> What's this? Uh, <laughs> Weston want to do this hand tracking thing. Yeah. Oh, Mac and cheese. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I knew that one. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're supposed to move back. I think you're a little too close, Wesley. I think you're too close. Here, come back here. Look. Right here, look. Hand over this. What? There you go, look. There you go. There you go. Put the pasta in. Weston's dream. He's obsessed with mac and cheese. <laughs> and the VR. Yeah, yeah it's kind of like that. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I love this game. I need to play with this. Uh, this was constant. Playing this one in real life all the time. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Ice cream, nice. Ice cream. Ice I'll try. You don't think you can lift it? Oh, yeah, I think I could. Uh, Did you lift it? It lifted it. It's lifted. There it goes. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's hard. You gotta run. <laughs> what was that? You had a toy in your pocket? Let me try. Nice job. <laughs> Way to go. You 
made it to the top. <laughs> See if you guys can lift up this motorcycle. Okay, push down. Look, it's moving. Go. Lifting. Like a just lifting it up on a teeter <laughs> Telescope. I don't think it's real. This one. We're making chemicals mix. Elemental <laughs> You would. <laughs> so check it out. They move this whole thing around. This is the, the thing. Oh my gosh, it's boggling my mind. They just I think it's the same the spot. They just redid the whole area. Whole new area to check out. Let's go check out the brain. Oh, Look, they got a demonstration lab. They probably do some science experiments. Oh, I hit this one. Yeah. Look. So since the last time we're here, this whole new section has been built, but it's pretty, pretty cool new section. Stop Don't taste anything. You look in here for sight. This one's supposed to make a smell. It does. It says smell the sniffing tube. <laughs> I don't know if I want to do that. Stop, it's like perfumey kind. Wait, no, you sniff this thing. I sniff it. Sniff it. I'm feeling that bowl. What? Nah. No. Whoa. Trip. That looks like a crazy machine. It's like medieval times in here. It's like 
<laughs> yeah, I think it makes the hand thing easier. <laughs> it's quantum computing, <laughs> quantum <laughs> physics. <laughs> <laughs> this is a regular old classic. Touch screen. Nice, nice. <laughs> I know. Maybe the hover. Hover board. Okay. Oh, hold on. Okay. Let's see what's up right here. Back to the brain. By time, does this knock over in time? In time. Can I crawl up you? <laughs> what about this one? That's not that scary. That's super scary. You would I wouldn't want to swim with that. <laughs> I think it's like a giant water scorpion. Look, sea scorpions. I mean, they're venomous then, too. I don't know. Yeah, then, no, I'm not going in. They didn't have stingers. They're venomous then, no. They didn't have stingers, they said. But still, you don't want to mess with that. What about this fish? What about that giant fish? That one's fine. You just swim with that? Wait, wait, wait. That's fine? I don't think it's No way, so man. I would probably ride on it. Ride on it. Oh. What happened when that spider came on the table or the restaurant the other week? <laughs> he jumped up on the chair. <laughs> Just spiders, not giant sea fish. This is a big gorgon too, it said. <laughs> they look kinda like the horse, so I can ride on them. These are so beautiful. What is this? That looks like a plant. It's like a giant plant piece. That's not kinda pretty. No, no, no. Oh, there's no hand tracking. You can't go. Post the source. It's from Post Texas. Says the only one in the world. So do you guys use a knife and fork when you eat dinner? Yes. <laughs> well, let me show you a guy who doesn't. Uh -huh. This guy doesn't use a knife and fork. That's the jaw of who's that? Do you guys remember that one? T Rex. T -Rex. Yeah, you see it right behind you. Huh. So you guys use knives and forks. He didn't even have a knife and fork. 
He had to take a bite and grab it and <laughs> throw it back and swallow it whole. Just like an alligator does today. Wow. Do you know how many sets of teeth you have? Um, how many sets? Ready, so. Well, you have, you, have, you have 30 <laughs> teeth, but how many sets? You have your baby teeth, and then you have... Your, Not teeth. That's right. <laughs> he gets new teeth his whole life, just like a shark. And you can see new ones coming in, because every now and then he would bite, and he'd hit the bone, and he'd break a tooth. So anytime you find a T-Rex, you usually find broken teeth and baby teeth and everything. Nice. But along with it, he didn't have a knife and fork, he also didn't have a toothbrush. Don't oh, wow. <laughs> So you guys need to take care of your teeth because you only get one set. This dude had so many teeth coming in all the time, he didn't need a toothbrush. Well, that's awesome. Good. <laughs> a bunch of rotten teeth. I huh? think yeah. he could get it in there with his little arms. Be pretty huh? hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> thank yeah. you. Okay. Enjoy your time. Thanks. <laughs> thanks. No way. They couldn't reach their mouth with their hands. They definitely could. They can only like reach their chest. Like the part, like on their chest. Like, yeah. They could only go like, this is how far their arms could reach. Like, <laughs> a gigantodactyl. Oh, that's what that thing was. Flying thing. Yeah, they are. I think yeah, so. That, that one's about the there. that's about the turtle there. Right. Apex predator. Sea Lake monster. Sea monster. Oh no. Sea monster. The it says a Tylosaurus for this one. No, it's the Mosasaurus. Looks like a Mosasaurus. No, it says the Mosasaurus. Uh, the Mosasaurus? That's right. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. I was reading this one. Tylosaurus. Of the inland ocean. Like one oh, that the was back brutal was inside there. Yeah, I know. So I guys, chop chop. Like, you just get chopped up and go. Like, you're not safe. You're not going to get swallowed. Or, like, you're going to get out of the stomach. It's good. Second teeth. Digital prints. <laughs> <laughs> oh, digital prints. <laughs> Big old turtle. Get one for the house. Yeah. Yeah. It could be like one million dollars. Super now. rich, yeah. I heard the rocks got a T Rex head at his house. The rock. He's got a real T Rex. A T Rex head, I think. A lot. <laughs> I just like yeah. <laughs> Still think <laughs> 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 So 
a mass mortality plate. You're not looking for one of those? No. I think it's probably like a little, uh, what's it called? Oh, it's those bird. I was going to say pterodactyl. Oh. I'm going to butcher that. Frigate? Frigate bird? Fergie bird? Fergie bird. It's a Colors are so beautiful. I know, they're really Sparkle cool. Tools, so interesting. Mm -hmm. Cow, how is it possible? If you read one of these plaques, I'll tell forms you. <laughs> precipitate from groundwater within and between the cells of buried logs. Minerals that precipitate within these logs can include calcite, calcium carbonate, Hematite, iron oxide, and py pyrite, iron sulfide, varieties of silica, silicon dioxide, including adjacent quartz and opal, may also precipitate within the wood. The colors of petrified wood often result from the presence of oxides of iron, manganese, and other materials. The red color of some petrified wood is caused by the presence of hematite. A highly oxidized form of iron, <laughs> and there's more, but I can't read it because Carter's bullying me. Yeah. <laughs> but the result is pretty cool. This is crazy right here. It's like a mirror. It's a white oak. That's cool. It's like a mirror, like. It's red, that one had a lot of iron. <laughs> I would like one of these as a wall decoration. Just like this. How do you even find one of these? I love well, this We've seen one. some of the non like cut up do versions at like that, that rock the rock store, store in Colorado. I, like I think it's just like cut and polished like a piece of granite, you know? Back to that you gotta go back and like get some. <laughs> back to the rock star. Yeah. This is a spruce right here. This one's huge. Look at this one. You stand in front of it for scale. You got it. I think these are so cool too. Really cool too. With the light in it, like what a nightlight that would be. Cool. Wouldn't be scared to swim with that. Yeah. Would not even be scared. The Meg. What about this? Would you be scared of this? Okay, was that western when he was little would not come around the corner for that? It was that one over there. It wasn't this, it was the, the sloth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sloth too. No, it's like an elephant. <laughs> no, not this one around the corner when you were little. You wouldn't ever go around this corner. This one right here. Sloth too. You would run up, you'd make me go back. You were, you wouldn't even around. come around this corner. <laughs> You're not going by sloth too. Now nah, he's facing his fears. Look. I'm not even scared of Slothzilla anymore. Don't fall. It's veggie. Yeah. Yeah. Those slashes. I'm not gonna touch it, no word. That is crazy, yeah. That's crazy. What is that? Giant armadillo. Armadillo. 
Angel Dillon's uh, <laughs> less intimidating than Sloss. Uh, <laughs> looks like Charles. Oh my gosh, tag. What? The, you know the bride movie with the fighting of like the rat creatures that kind of rise. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. This yeah. the giant armadillo. Is that the princess bride? That's the, the princess bride. That's the that giant. Kind of that's the armadillo okay, zilla. So that's the armadillo That's the armadillo zilla. That's the armadillo regular, zilla. regular this giant armadillo. And I'd be scared of this one and that one. <laughs> Look at that hairy belly. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not scared of flies in the wild. I'm scared of flies in the wild. It's just an elephant. But if it's eating humans, cool, I wouldn't sorry. be scared. I'd be scared of it if it's eating humans. I think the humans are trying to eat it, so it's eating them. Okay. It's not that scary. And then Carter can whip the mountain crap. Well, I'm having soda. I decided to come back to pump up the soda. <laughs> two. Going to level two. Mama. Got this, 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 this. <laughs> but you can't see me on the green screen. So check out these shells. Those are some big. Yeah. I think that might be what goes inside the shell. That thing's or, so small. What? I don't know. Looks oh. weird. Is that the gastropod? Hey. I think so. I don't know. We're going to look real quick. Cool. We're not going to go down. I'm, I'm thinking that's the gastropod. I think so. I think you might be right. I can't say it correct. I keep saying gastropod. I feel like this is better than that shell museum that we went to. <laughs> In, I think it was uh, Sanibel Island in Florida. No offense, Sanibel Island. Shell museum. It costs $30 to get in. That would be crazy, like on the beach. Yeah. Look at this. Whoa. Look at this. Ooh, look at that one. Whoa. That oyster? It looks like a giant one, kind of. Yeah, it's got without It has little numbers on it. I can't see what number that is. It's four, yeah. Four is. I have no idea how you say that. Cassie's Cassie's Turbosa. Turbosa. From Brazil. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, no, it's not about the lines over here. <laughs> Mama, look over here. Oh, no. Yeah, I got numbers okay, over there, too. Okay, okay. Still this can't sorry, pronounce it. You're so smart. Okay, Pink so that's from the Maxima. Philippines. 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 Good looking at it. Philippines. The ones on the left side, yeah. That's right. Interesting. There's an abalone. Look how pretty that is. Somebody like knitted the middle of that? Oh no, it's it Phil's to shells. my mother. <laughs> Somebody made it for their mom. I thought it was knitted there, but that's seashell. That's seashell. That one's crazy. Spiral and thing. Look how shiny that is. I know. That's cool. Look at this one. That's an ice cream. That's an ice cream. It looks like an ice cream, but it's down. Right. Don't eat it, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
Ooh. A little tiny ice cream. <laughs> Lots of ice cream ones, huh? There's a video. They're so super tiny. There's a video of somebody. Like the one I have in the cars. Yeah. Super tiny. There's a video. There's a little tiny ice cream. Oh, look, they're going to give me a tiny one. Oh, they want the ice cream. So many ice cream. I hope he's going to want ice cream after this. Come on. Ooh, nice. It says so I don't break it. Yep. It says the feel of the shell can tell you a lot about the kind of mollusk you're touching. What kind of mollusk you're touching? Ooh, there's more on the wall over here, too. That's it, Papi Gentle. Whoa! Ice cream! 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 Ice they paint them? I don't know. It looks like they might be natural. Sure. Yeah. I don't want that flea market bag. It's for me. Or not flea market. Farmer's yeah, market. Yeah, farmer's market. <laughs> There's a farmer's Bucket market when we walked in today on the outside here <laughs> on Sunday. So, uh, okay. We're going to you know, look at it from here. We're not going to go down there. We'll go to the gemstones here. Look at the giant Hall of gems and minerals. I love this one. It's one of my favorites. It's cool. So quiet. Look at them. They're just so magical. It's just so quiet in here. Big old geo. This looks crazy. Wow, that looks like eyeballs. It looks kind of like eyeballs, huh? Eye Creepy, isn't it? Looks kind of Bati Tourmaline. The Smoky Quartz. The Vault. Hopefully, we won't get locked in. Going into the Vault. It's okay, It's okay, Does it actually close? It does. No, it's not close. Look. 
It's okay, Aubrey. It's okay. <laughs> James. It's a gorilla. Gorilla. Well, what is that? Made out of obsidian, it says. Wow, look at that. What is that? Yeah, quartz. Is that it? Monkey guy. That's a special thing. Walrus. <laughs> this one has to be made out of like gold or something. Mm, let's see what it says over here. Right here. It says the walrus. Manus, Garus, Brazil, Haggy, Manchu. Green. Ooh. It's tail's gold. Somebody carved that out of rocks. Pretty crazy. Blackberries. Blackberries. <laughs> says raspberries, actually. Oh, raspberries. Oh, least favorite. Oh, no. <laughs> say anything. <laughs> Any of these rock names are probably Words. wrong that we're saying. Or the shellfish or anything. Yeah. Oh yeah. Shell creatures. There's a chameleon on a big branch. I didn't say that. <laughs> That's for sure. Opal. Very cool. Birthstone. Yes. <laughs> Shit. Uh, coming out of the vault. <laughs> yeah, it's a very quiet, like low key section. You want to sneak through quietly. So, we just left the gemstone section. We're going to head into the Hall of African Wildlife. I think they're like uh, taxidermy. Yeah, it was like uh, named after a couple people. It didn't say specifically. I don't think what the hall was. So there we go. Texas Ferris Hall of Texas Wildlife. So, we got everything that we got here in Texas and had here. I guess some extinct stuff. That's an alligator. We don't have crocodiles, right? American alligator. American alligator. Right there. Oh, Eating that know? pig. Alligators um, usually have like rounder faces like that, I think, too. Yeah. The crocodiles are like longer and pointier. Like a longer snout. Yeah. I don't think we have crocodiles here in Texas. Like bald eagles. Eagles, Carter. Eagles. Oh. Mama, what is that? <laughs> well, fox, I'm guessing. Coyote, maybe? I, I, maybe oh, okay. I don't know. Did you get 
<laughs> I don't know if that one might be on the other one right there. That is a gray fox right there, but I don't know if that's. What are those? Mama was right. Wait, fox. I think, I think that stinks on you. Yeah, that stinks, stinks on, on you. you. Yep. That's, that's a skunk. <laughs> you see where the skunk is? Yeah. Right there. It stinks on you. It stinks on you. <laughs> it <stinks> on you. <laughs> So you don't want to mess with the skunk. It had the thing before. I don't know if it's go under the rock there. Before the skunk like used to move when you go in front of it, but I don't think it's on right now. Stand up. I think the woodpecker's still working. Oh, just the sound. I think some of the animations might be off. That's not. What is that? What is that? Come over here. Are... That's like a bobcat. The ocelot's over there. That's a bobcat for sure. <laughs> what is this one, Mama? I love the guy uh, here. That's an ivory billed woodpecker. That's how obvious. Of course. It's the piney woods. So we still have some black bears in the piney woods. Oh, yeah, right there. A rainforest big eared bat. What is this? A raccoon. What is this? Black bears. Look, it's right there, Carter. There's a bear. <laughs> yeah, Red Wolf. That one's the ocelot right there. <laughs> oh, here comes another. Okay, that's what, what's that? Let's see. Where do they call Those it? Those are the collared picard. Mom, what is this one? They're saying. What is this one? Wait a minute, is this jaguar? They got jaguars down by the, the Grande River. Yeah. Sorry, I'm Look, it's um, in the air. It's laying eggs there. Look, Can you see it's over there? Ooh. Baby turtles. Baby turtle, that is a full baby turtle. Yep. Who's that? An egg. You want to see the egg right there? Now one just rolled towards this hole. Listen, I noticed. What? That's a giant turtle. That's just a normal sized turtle. It's a sea turtle. It's so giant. Cook, 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 cook. Mm. Oh. Ew. This one, this one. It's turkey. Got the bison. Oh. Aubrey, just showing me this. The mountain lions were considered extinct in Texas until recently, and collaboration with others was even staff. Talking about mountain lions in Katy, Pasadena, and Humble. Yeah. Crazy. That's where we're camping. Just the other week was up here in Brazoria. That's Galveston over there. Yep, and we are just in Galveston a couple weeks before that.
Is it Flayburg? Wants to go to Padre Island. Flayburg. I want to slide this. I want to slide this. Okay. I'm out. Okay. I'm out. Can we have to drive the Climber? Yeah. Take it out. Carter wants to slide. Cleaver County. I don't know if it's safe or not, but. Not today, but we'll do it. We'll do it one of these days. We're going backwards. We'll have to name this hall on the way out. But what's this place remind you of? The Cabinet of Curiosities. Reminds us of that section. I don't know if any of you guys watch Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. He goes into the hunter's house. Yeah. There's stuff there in there. So it has Look. a sign on it here. Can you gently watch your face? Oh, but don't touch it. Just, you just okay, peek yeah. in the drawer. Bones and stuff in there. That's snake skin. Mm. That's big. Yeah. That's a big snake. Uh huh. Yeah, cabinet of curiosities. All right, so I think that's, that's it for floor two. <laughs> that would be cool. <laughs> that's basically floor two. Maybe we'll show this little overlook here. So yeah, one more thing on floor two. Got a couple of little fossils here. Then you got this super cool overlook of floor one dinosaur area. They do reservations for like weddings and parties and stuff here. Sometimes they have this thing get closed off for being yep, really yeah. cool event space here where you can oversee all of the okay, dinosaurs. cool spot. We've never done it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See all the dinosaurs from above. Pretty cool little lookout area. And the floor three. Let's go. Come on, come on. It was already ready to roll. Oh, it's busy. Yeah. Sometimes it's really busy. Sometimes it's really busy. Yeah. It's good. Great time. Yeah. Great time. Alright. This is the floor with the mummies. All of Egypt. This one creeps me out a little bit. It's another one of those quiet floors. Never stay quiet. There's a mummy right here. See a reign of Rem Remesses too, so he was king, I think. Twelve
There's a mummy. <laughs> we don't usually come on this section because the mummies give us the Hebrew jeepers. Yeah, we're showing it just for the video, but yeah, kind of a little creepy to me at least. I don't know. Here's the mummies. There's a real mummy over there, I think. I see. Check it out, I haven't gone in there yet. It's cold over here. Got a pretty good drawing. It's got a different style. All right, we're leaving ancient Egypt. <laughs> we landed all of the Americas. So I think this is like early America, Native American section. <laughs> Wow, did they really make them that tall, you think? Like, I don't know, maybe, yeah. Possibly. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Look, there's the pizza there. Wow. I think they're, they're getting carrots. They're making some food. Yeah, they're making food. I think what they're doing is grabbing carrots. That one has, like, something like this bowl of milk or something. Mm -hmm. And then <laughs> Just want some moccasins for that purse that was at the front. <laughs> <laughs> Those rock that we're at, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Restored rock shelter. Those are cool, huh? 
think this is more like in the Alaskan region. Yeah, like north, Alaska northwest. Guy inside of that. Northwest nations. Yeah, all these ones. Inside of, inside of like a dragon. Here's the kicker with the wolf. It doesn't grow in our rain forests. So they had to trade for it in drier areas that border our rainforests. So we're going to Canada or Oregon. Oh, that's sweet. You're going to sleep. Yeah, she's going to sleep. Sleep when we die. That blanket looks pleasant. That does look good. That's the blanket. Spear. Tire. I don't know if they call it something else, but still call them a kayak. <laughs> Snuggly suit. It's a woman's wedding coat. It's look like what mama wears every day almost, you know. <laughs> you can still see the pendulum from up here. So we're all up on the third floor. The pendulum still pokes through. You can see all the way down. Oh my God. We're so high up now. It's like Carter when he's angry. That's scary. <laughs> <laughs> Got a turtle on a stick right there. I bet it rattles. Probably, yeah. Number 30. Turtle rattle. 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 Got Good this. call, Mama. Good Turtle call. Turtle shell, bamboo wax, cotton fibers. Used by shamans in healing rituals. Nice. Rituals. Mama, did Baba come over here? Come oh, over look. It's another <laughs> angry card. <laughs> <laughs> it's that card already gets angry. That's what I thought. <laughs> we're gonna cruise back through here, then we're heading heading for the fourth floor. That one you can't catch guys. Look at my hand. Projector. Alright, let's go to the fourth floor. But it's starting to lose it a little bit here. I will say, if you're going to do all four floors with kids, it is kind of tough to get it all done in like one day. So, I mean. If you're going to be in Houston for Especially a while, if you live in Houston, if the season passes are definitely... Memberships, annual. annual membership is definitely worth it. If you're in the area. If you're in the area. Right. Yeah. <laughs> We've done it for many years, so... Yeah. I don't know, at least five. We get it every year, basically. Can you get it the other Fourth floor. Heading up to the energy hall. Yeah, what? we rarely ever do it all the floors what, in one this, day. If you really want to like look at stuff and is read this the, the last info. Floor? It's the last floor. Yes. It takes, like, a while. takes a while. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you could do it in a day. <laughs> if you blaze through, you can definitely do it. Or if you have all day to spend here. <laughs> Zabri's favorite. favorite Zabri's favorite section. <laughs> The energy hall. I'll be dancing over there.
Weiss energy hall. Texas City Active. Oh, they changed this into one of those uh, the ones the kids are liking. It's got one of those things. It's the VR thing. The kids have been loving all these new VR ones. They got them all up here in the lower floor. Oh, all right. Come on, Westy. Everybody's going. We're going over here. We'll check out more in a little bit here. The Geo I won't be scared this time. That one wasn't that crazy. I think the other one was the crazy one. Weston was like freaking out when first son went in there. Let's go in there anyway. Yeah, he was like Carter Don't care. We need it for. We need everybody to see it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I, I would say that this the fourth floor and now the first floor, the new section there on the first floor, definitely the most kid friendly sections. Like a lot more, you know, interactive. They can kind of be a little bit louder and stuff. Some of like the other ones, like the gemstone area and the uh, that the mummy section are like super quiet. Like you know, gotta whisper through there. <laughs> oh, see. Yeah. I'll see you, Come on, get in there. I can't see from here. Yeah, there. <laughs> you guys your head in. I gotta lift you up, I think. Here. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Ready, Abby? Why won't that move? Abby! Hello! <laughs> You know what? She's too scared of the dark holes. <laughs> yeah, you put your arms in. <laughs> All right, we'll let Cardi have a turn. Cardi! Hi! <laughs> A flying car. So cool. So they do have these things right here. It's kind of like a interactive ride video kind of thing. But I think we're gonna skip it today. First time Western went in there, he was super freaked out. And we got Carter here. He might, he might get crazy. <laughs> They're not that scary. They're not that. They're but. not that scary. But it's kind of just like a ride that you like. Uh, Dragging you me. just sit in a seat and <laughs> it wiggles a little bit and it shows you like a, a, vid a giant video, a video experience. Get the oils. We got here West Texas Blend. <laughs> Some games here. Toddler. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. We got a steering wheel. Oh, I'm almost driving the truck. Here we go. You just fly it into the truck. Okay, ready? <laughs> Vortex, it says. Enter the vortex. What is this? Power to the people. I don't 
if they changed into lights instead of the Wait, thing that goes in? So they changed they it. They used to have they used to be a thing, yeah. Why you used to have a thing that went through it, it, but. They used to have one of those. See, lights control the lights. It is working. It is working. Having too many male functions with the old system. Fracture network inside the tank. <laughs> <laughs> it's making bubbles. It's making bubbles. <laughs> it makes bubbles. <laughs> Careful, no Back to Egypt. Back to Egypt. They made mummies out of oil. Heavy oil. They used it back in the day. As I said, in ancient times they used oil for construction, heavy oil for construction, and to make movies. I guess they've been, they've been digging it up for a while. Man. It's here. It's just got a uh, projection onto it, but it's actual pieces that are here. Yeah, the projections are moving. That's how they frack, I think. What? Oh, 
I think it's supposed to connect the pipes right there, or the drill bit, I guess. So yeah, they got, it's like a big oil drilling rig. You can buy a Mosasaur head for only $185,000. <laughs> Don't touch anything. <laughs> 10,000 bucks for a piece of copper. You know, your fish fossils, 7,800 for a small one. <laughs> the geese are coming. Oh, no, no, it's probably. 